Art, Literature, and Architecture of the Middle Ages. Words to Learn. Art, what is made by a person's hands. Literature, written works of art. Architecture, how buildings are made. Art of the Middle Ages. Byzantine art. Art that didn't look like real life. The art usually was symbolic or meant something special. They were usually about religion. Romanesque art. Art that focused on religion included stained glass, murals, carvings, illuminated manuscripts, and sculptures. Gothic art. Art that looked more real, used brighter colors, shadows, and light. The art included religion and animals. Artists of the Middle Ages. Donatello, an Italian sculptor. Sculptors make things out of stone or other hard things. Giotto, an Italian artist famous for his frescoes in churches. A fresco is when you paint on walls of plaster. Benvenuto di Giuseppe, also called Simoni. An artist from Florence, famous for paintings and mosaics. Mosaics use small pieces of stone, glass, or tile of different colors to make a picture. Ambriogio Lorenzetti, an Italian painter. Known for his fresco, The Allegory of Good Government and The Allegory of Bad Government. Literature of the Middle Ages. Beowulf. A famous epic or long poem. A poem is when words written rhyme and tell how someone feels. The Canterbury Tales Written by Geoffrey Chaucer about life in England when he was alive. The Divine Comedy Written by Dante Alighieri his story of what happens when you die. Mort de Written by Thomas Mallory. Stories about King Arthur. Other writings. Hedman's Hymn. This hymn or religious song recorded by a monk is the oldest surviving Old English poem, The Book of Marjorie Kemp, by Marjorie Kemp. This book is considered to be the first autobiography written in English. The Ecclesiastical History of the English People, by Venerable Bede. This history of the English Church earned Bede the title, Father of English History. The Decameron, by Giovanni Boccaccio. This book has a number of stories and describes life in 14th century Italy. The Travels of Marco Polo by Marco Polo. This book tells the story of how Marco Polo traveled to the Far East in China. Piers Plowman by William Langland. 
This poem tells of a man in search of the true Christian life. Architecture of the Middle Ages Byzantine Architecture Use domes in buildings to create a strong look. An example of this is the Hagia Sophia. Romanesque Architecture Use thick walls round arches and large tower. An example is the Leaning Tower of Pisa. Gothic architecture. Had tall buildings, pointed arches, big windows, and pictures carved into the building. The most famous is Notre Dame. Castles were built to protect people. Castles would have towers and spires. This is a spire. Buildings would have flying buttresses to keep the building from falling, stained glass telling Bible stories, and would often be made of stone. Most houses were of wood and thatch. Thatch is a roof made of plants. Isn't it cute?